Hello, I'm changing the water pump on the B230 Volvo engine. I start by draining the coolant and removing the water pump pulley. I use a rubber strap wrench to loosen nuts. The pulley is off the pump. Then I have to remove the top section timing belt cover. One screw on the back. Two bolts here. Those are different, so they have to come back the same way. One more bolt. And the cover is off. The water pump is out, time to clean the surface. You can use chemicals like this to clean old gasket or a brass wire brush. You must be careful there, don't scratch it. I put the seal on the pump. Then I hang gasket on two studs. I always put it dry there and I never had any leak. Gasket for heater core pipe, just at the tip. The pump. Now I secure the pump with washers and nuts on studs, just to keep it in place. The washer. Since the other stud is just over the lower timing belt cover, I don't want to drop the nut there. I use a small socket to guide the nut onto the stud. I drive those nuts close to the body of the water pump, but don't tighten them. To put the other bolts in place, I will use a trick. With splash guard removed, I place a piece of wood on the floor and under the pump. Now, when I gently, you hear me? I said gently, press on the bumper, the pump goes up, the top seal is compressed to the head and I can screw in those bolts with ease. Checking if all bolts are in. It is a good time to change the coolant. Always use one that is formulated for the car. Use either original Volvo coolant or Xerex G48.
It is important due to the materials used in the engine. Always use distilled water to dilute coolant. Put everything back together, burp the system, start the engine, check for leaks, buckle up, enjoy the ride.